Sovereign Grace Community. Report 2023 Ministries. We are located at Puerto Princesa City, Palawan. 197 Arnaldo Tan Building. Room 6, Basement. Along Rizal Avenue. Within the vicinity of Baranga Imungyuhan. The landmark is the TLC Veterinary Clinic. The occupant at the front of Mr. Tan Building. Reasons to thank God for. Here are the four reasons. And now here are the updates which took place in 2023. New members, the Orago family. We are frequently visited by fellow believers to worship together. Some are already embraced the Reformed theology. Better known the doctrines of grace. They are from different places and churches. Some are even pastors themselves. Others are individuals who just want to worship in a community where the right teaching is being upheld promoted and defended but we believe that the Holy Spirit is drawing them to us to be fed with the pure spiritual milk of the word because we are a community who just love the Lord and his words in its pureness Bible distribution the beneficiaries are people who were evangelized and are undergoing Bible studies through the SGC ministries God is not unjust. He will not forget how hard you have worked for him. By caring for other believers, as you still do. Hebrews 6 verse 10. Outreach Ministry Locals such as those in El Nido. Tribe members such as those in Brooks Point. like our hunger for God's words. They are eager to learn and enthusiastic to know the Lord more. Be thankful in all circumstances, for this is God's will. For you who belong to Christ Jesus. 1 Thessalonians chapter 5 verse 18. In the end of the year 2023, SGC and Palaan tribe gathered together to thank the Lord and worship for the good things he has done for all of us. Pulpit Ministry Preaching Engagement In every preaching, the doctrine of grace and the sovereignty of God have been the theme and promoted. Reformation Outspread Ministry Continued teachings to local pastors and churches we continue to edify the young pastors. It is by serving as mentor and coach to them. Pastor Jolmar Halalyera, the third from the right, stopped from serving the church of his parents. He put up a local church where the five pillars of the Reformation are embraced. This is the result of continued enlightenment from the scriptures. SGC ministry has traveled even as far as to the aloof and yet promising leaders of their particular churches. Here are our prayer concerns. Help us by praying for these items. God's provision for a plan to procure a slot for a local radio ministry. Our target is the DYSP radio broadcasting station. It is by far the most popular among the list. Help us to pray about God's provision for a decent worship house to be used by the Palaan tribe. The husbands promise to attend the worship service if this is granted. They are worried from thinking that the floor would collapse if they also climb up.
pursuance of the two young aspiring members and workers for SGC. Mentoring and teaching these two young pastors. They gladly accepted the reformed doctrine as they realized that it is the biblical understanding of salvation. In turn, they renounced what had been imbued upon them. By their professors from the Bible school in which both of them studied and graduated after four years. Thank you Valley View Baptist Church and Heart Cry Missionary Society. Thank you Lord, bringing them to us. May God continue to prosper you and enlarge your ministries for his glory. Thank you.